Welcome to Get Offset. My name is Emily and I'm here to talk about something very important to me and that is your laugh. It's lovely. It's infectious. When you laugh, I laugh. It's a sympathetic thing. It's wonderful. Don't ever change. But I'm also here to talk about something that uh, is really exciting for me as somebody who plays with a lot of charts. I know a guitarist who can read charts. <laughs> but any musician I think would really appreciate this, whether your chart is lyrics or tabs or actual sheet music, uh, this is a great tool, it's called the Stritch. But first, let's talk about uh, playing charts on stage. Personally for me, I do a lot of pickup gigs and a lot of tribute night gigs. And what that means is I have to learn a lot of songs in a very short period of time for one, maybe two shows. And it's exciting, it's fun, it really keeps me on my toes, but I, can't, I, I am not gonna memorize all that. I just can't, I have other things going on in my life, so I rely on charts. And the chart software I use is called Paperless Music, and you can see it right here. This is actually a chart from one of my disco gigs coming up. But uh, what do you do when your chart has multiple pages in the middle of a very important part, which seems to happen a lot? You have to, you have to flip the page. And then often, like with this one, you have to flip back. I'm pretty sure you have to flip back. No. So you don't have to flip back on this one, but you often have to flip back again. And when you're playing guitar, you have to pull away from the strings and flip and hope that you get it right the first time. And uh, sometimes that doesn't happen very easily. This app does have tools that you can use to change the page, turn the page without touching it. It's called facial gestures, but uh, they are kind of funny. They will make you look funny on stage. Uh, so I have it so I can blink and kind of make my eye, like, there you go, you see it there. I can blink to go forward or backwards. I can make my mouth do weird things. And uh, that's real fun to do on a stage. <laughs> you don't look dumb at all doing that. It's really a goofy thing. And the worst part is it, it's, in an environment like this, it's well lit. Uh, it's, it's kind of fine. But on a stage, the stage is darker. Uh, it may not be able to pick up on your motions as well. So you might not turn the page when you need to. What's worse, you might, you might turn the page when you don't mean to. You might, if you have it set to winks, uh, you, you might just close your eye and it will like turn the page. Or if you have other facial gestures like turning your head, which is another one of those options, uh, you can just go look at somebody. Because the thing about my charts gigs is you do have to look at the chart, you have to follow the chart, but you also need to watch everybody else because you don't play together a lot. So that makes it really hard. Stretch, however, makes that really easy. This is the stretch. It is nice and small. It's also very thin, which is really neat. And there are a few different modes on it. If you look at it, you can kind of see what the modes do. It's set to left and right. Uh, you can also have up and down because this can work with like computers. Maybe your chart is just like a big Word document and you're just trying to, trying to go down it. Um, but you can do different things with it. Up, page up, page down, scroll up, scroll down, left click, right click. And then there's one other one that I forget, but uh, what is that? And then the final one is space and enter. That's the only one that I think isn't really obvious by the, um, by the buttons there. So I'm gonna hold this up in front of me. I've already connected it to Bluetooth. So there's my Bluetooth settings. There's my general settings. So there's my Bluetooth settings and you can see Bluetooth music pedal is what it appears as and it sure is indeed that. Let me go that way. So let's go forward a page. Oh, it just works. Oh my goodness, it's just working. And you can have it set on repeat or you can turn off repeat. If you turn off repeat, if you hold down, it only goes down one. But if you turn repeat on, you can scroll forward a bunch. So I'm gonna put this on the floor and uh, let's just kind of go back and forth. So going all the way to the beginning on the radio. What? Uh, uh, uh. 
Since I wasn't able to do a real gig with the stretch before they wanted me to deliver this video, I decided to take it to the local park for some busking. It stayed connected to my iPad even days later. Unfortunately, the audio didn't turn out. It was very windy, but this thing just works. And it's a little bit hard to see in this next shot, but you can see the page turn if you look closely enough. So yeah, again, it just works great. I don't know what else to tell you guys. This this just works. It just works. I don't know what else you want in a video. It worked seamlessly. It's not very expensive. It's really small. You can throw it in any gig bag. I love a good little tool that just works. It charges using USB-C. It comes with USB-C cable. It came really quickly. Uh, I'm pretty sure they're on Amazon. Check it one out via the links in the video description. We have other affiliate links as well. But yeah, I, I don't know what to say about this. I don't know how to make this video longer. This, this, it just works. Watch it, watch it work. <laughs> I'm, I'm giddy. I cannot wait to gig with this. So thank you to Stretch for sending me this to check out. Uh, my, my opinion is that it, it, it just works. And I'm sure there are other things that do this, but this is small. It's easy to understand. You just connect it and it worked seamlessly with paperless music, which is what I use. Other recommended apps are Fourscore, YIBook, I guess that's YeeBook, Music Stand, Next Page, Music Reader 4, DD Gigbook, Teleprompt 3, and Pia Score. So once again, cool little product for everybody out there. Uh, we have a Patreon at patreon.com slash get offset that gives you access to our exclusive Discord server. We have merch at getoffsetpodcast.com slash shop. Uh, again, affiliate links in the video description. I, my favorite way to support the channel is to tell your favorite brands about me and uh, like, comment, and subscribe. You can also drop like a thanks or a super chat if you feel so inclined, but you don't. I understand you don't do that. To everybody out there, thanks for watching. Thanks for understanding. Until next time, my name is Emily. Goodbye.